Hello guys and welcome to today's episode where today, as you can see from the title and the thumbnail, we are going to be trying something very very interesting. So today, as you can see in our army camps, we have a mass minion attack strategy. So if I do go into the army composition, you're going to see 120 minions. Then from these spells, we've got 4 raid spells, a single poison spell and 2 haste spells. Honestly, these spells are queued up literally so randomly, I didn't even know. I had a jump spell, which I thought I removed because the minions cannot use the jump spell then we have seven balloons and a single haste spell within the clan castle and our heroes obviously now as you can see from the title and the thumbnail i believe in the thumbnail not quite sure though, but in the title it says 240 dark elixir and yes you guys i know minions are more expensive but if we do go into here you're gonna see they are currently only two dark elixir so you can train up 120 minions for only 240 dark elixir so turtle because if you train up 120 minions that's going to cost you two dark elixir per minion two times 120 is 240 yeah i know great maths right i'm a genius okay but that said we are going to test this out and see if they can actually three star a base now obviously we are going to have to search for a dead base because if we go against a base with inferno towers for example we are not going to be doing well so this space would be a good example but what i don't like about this space is it's not a hundred percent dead because the queen is actually under construction so that means this guy may have many air traps so he's just dropped in the uh, sort of tombstones he's just left them there so that people think that his base is dead and uh, yeah so people fall for it and then they lose but anyways we are still going to search for example this base would be a really really good example but this guy literally has no loot whatsoever we even if it would freestyle the base we would gain less dark elixir literally 240 dark elixir is what we needed to train up the army and we would only get 130 in return so that is not good at all so let me just find a base and once i find a base i will be back with you guys and then we're going to see if we can three star it two star it one star it i don't know i literally got no idea how this is going to go so give me a second i'll find a base and i'll be right back Okay, here we go, you guys. This is literally again the exact next base I search for. I don't know what is going on, but every time I say I will be back in a few moments, it is the next base. So I don't know what's going on. Uh, YouTube literally just wants me to edit these parts out, but I guess that's fine. So we are going to attack the space, you guys, and hopefully we can three star it. So check this out. This guy does have 270,000 gold, 119,000 elixir, and a little bit of dark elixir. So how we're going to do this is I think I want to sort of create a funnel. So so we do have a ton of minions so i'm going to use just a few two on every structure to get the minions to go into the center after that so there we go this should be okay let's just drop in a few more minions over on the outside just to secure ourselves a few more percentage points for the case that we do fail on getting the three stars so we, now we have 94 minions left so this is going to work out perfectly i think because the arch queen is alive but she's not going to do any damage whatsoever so we're going to drop in the three haste balls in a nice line once these minions take out the storage Okay, there they go. So one, two, and three hex balls. There we go, you guys. Now let's spam in all of our minions. This is actually hilarious. So we're gonna drop in one and two raid balls. Let's see how much damage these minions can do. Hopefully they don't all die by that wizard towers. There we go, you guys. Minions doing a ton of work, and uh, yeah, they're not being taken out by wizard towers any longer. So we still have a lot of minions. It does look a little bit unlikely that we're gonna be getting the three star though, because there are two more wizard towers which are going to do a lot of damage. We we still have three minutes left and a race ball so i'm gonna drop in the race ball over on this side i know it was pretty much useless and uh, yeah that didn't work out too great you guys we did manage to get the three star but we're gonna drop in one minion over here another one and another one but even the, the even with us not getting the three star we still gain a little bit of dark elixir now i know the space didn't have too much dark elixir so we didn't profit too much but we still got a little bit of dark elixir about a hundred is what we gained i think and uh, yeah so let's check it out 
you guys the two final minions are going to die in three two one bam there we go you guys so now we are going to have to end the battle and we got a total of a ton of gold actually a decent amount of elixir and 324,000 uh, sorry oh my god 324 dark elixir which means we basically got about 100 dark elixir in return so now we have another minion army composition i'm going to train up just another one just in case if this video does need another attack and we're going to actually train up a heal spell this time so we're going to train up two heal spells and two three rage spells okay yeah that should be good and then a single poison spell for the next attack you guys that is if we do attack another time after this attack so we've got again 120 minutes now the difference in this attack than the previous attack is that we have 10 haste spells and no rage spells no heal spells whatsoever so this should be very very interesting you guys so by the way if you are still watching and you would like to farm with minions i would definitely recommend it just boost your barracks for a little bit and then just start attacking with minions you're gonna prove so so profitable and it's going to be so quick you guys it's literally going to be so quick to train up the minions and uh, wow what is this base by the way 1000 gold and elixir of each and this is such an engineered base you know what i think i may need a uh, a screenshot from this because this guy may actually have high level troops for another video maybe i don't know you guys will see that in a future video if that is the case so let me find a base again because it doesn't look like these super soul gods do want me to find a base whilst i'm doing a live commentary so i swear if the next base if the base we are going to attack i am literally going to I, I don't know okay give me a second i'll find a base and i'll be right back okay so check this out you guys we just came across simba right here and he is going to be very sad when he sees that we absolutely annihilate the heck out of this base now the good thing about this base is first of all it's a dead base meaning the inferno towers and expos are both down and the collectors are full with loot now the second positive thing is that the air defenses are very 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 low level i mean they're such low level i don't even know what level they are because i have not seen such an air defense in such a long time i'm not even kidding you guys i literally have no idea what level that is maybe level three level two something like that i do not know right now but i believe that we can most likely three star this base not 100 percent guaranteed though because we only have haste spells so keep that in mind the minions may die by the wizard towers and that is why i actually want to use the heal spells within the next attack that is if we do another attack so check the tell you guys we are going to drop in one two three four five haste spells like so let's drop in all of our minions like this i don't even care if we do a funnel or not let's just spam in all of the minions wow this is actually pretty crazy so there we go another three haste spells hopefully these minions can speed through these defenses we've got a bunch of minions over on the top of the base and the minions they don't seem to be doing too much damage even in such big groups they don't seem to be doing a lot of damage which is very very interesting i thought they'd do more damage come on minions do some damage please now we don't have any more haste spells because we just dropped our final minions but uh, the jump bomb right there from the bomb tower actually doesn't take out air units which is very interesting and uh, there we go another few minutes going to take out that air defense let's actually drop in our king and queen for distraction and maybe we can get the three star you guys is this possible can we get a three star with only using 240 dark lecture that would be absolutely crazy check this out you guys this is actually going to be a three star i cannot believe this this is hilarious you guys let's pop the queen ability let's pop the king ability and we are going to get ourselves the three star and three two one and bam oh, oh okay okay never mind that was a total fail with my bat right there because we still have a few build slots on the outside of the base but that is for 99 percent and the minions are coming for the win you guys and the build slot is going to fall in three to one bam okay perfect three star 100 percent we got a total of 250,000 dark elixir 280,000 elixir and 212 dark elixir at the loot bonus that is about 300 dark elixir and that means we made a profit of about 100 dark elixir which honestly isn't the greatest but that is not the fault of the attack that is the fault of the base not having now enough loot so if we would find a base with more dark elixir we would obviously make a ton of profit now let's return back to base check out if our next army is ready so we do have a hundred and no actually we have 65 minions done five minutes for the next army to train up and three minutes for the spell so you know what i think i need to wait just a little bit and then i'm going to do one final attack for you guys so see you in just a moment
Okay, so we are back, you guys, and check this out. We just landed on Palugeda right here. I think I did pronounce that correctly. And this guy has a ton of loot 300,000 of each and 1.8 thousand dog collection. Now, we are obviously not going to be three star in this space, but we are going to see if we can gain every single job of the loot. So, we've got three raid spots and two heal spots, which should be able to do the job. So, we can actually not snipe on a single building, I don't think. So, that minion was an accident, but we can snipe the tower. Town hall, so another town hall, the clan castle. That is a positive thing. Maybe the barracks right here, and yes, we can. Maybe uh, the builder's sword, I think. Yeah, okay, but that's not going to help out too much. So, what we're going to do is we are just going to spam in a few minutes over on these collectors, then a few over on this sword. So, hopefully, we can get this gold storage and the dark elixir draw. And now we're just going to go in from the top of the base with one, two, and three raid spells. This should be pretty fun, you guys. There we go. All of the minions have now been deployed. There we go. Select a different unit that is because i just spammed in all of the minions let's drop one heal spot over here on these minions hopefully they can stay alive for a little longer than uh heal spot over on these minions because they are all dying by the archer tower let's drop in that point spot on the archer queen archer tower no it's an archer queen okay and the minions are staying alive a little longer did we get the dark legs over on this side yes we did that's pretty cool and uh, we still have a gold mine over on the left hand side and a gold mine over on the right hand side now it seems like we are not going to get the town hall and yeah but we have have a few balloons I believe in the clan castle which are not going to help out at all so we've got two options right here you guys let me know down below in the comment section what you would do in my place if you were me right now what would you do a would you could do would you go for the town hall or B would you put your archer queen on the left hand side and your queen over on the right hand side to get the 100,000 gold now look at my gold storages they are basically full to the top but I think I'm going to go for the gold storages so they go barbarian king over on this side and the Queen over here. Let's pull both of the hero's abilities and now let's end the battle. So we've got a total of 306,000 gold, 304,000 elixir, and 1.8,000 dark elixir. That means we did a much, much bigger profit than in the previous raids. Now let's return back to base and see if we can upgrade something. Now, obviously, we can upgrade something. Oh, we completed the event, which is pretty awesome. 30 gems to the collection, not really anything too great. Um, but actually, no, that is pretty good because that is going to reduce the cost of the barracks I have to boost because I forgot to train up these armies and we're going to upgrade a wall actually so we're gonna do this in three two one BAM! There we go, you guys. That is 1 million gold for a level 8 wall to go up to level 9. Then we have to complete the rest of the level 8 walls over on this side of the base. And then we're going to have to do the level 9 walls up to level 10. And then we are going to have to continue the level 10 walls up to level 11, which is going to be a pain in the yeah, you know what. And uh, we're still going to do that. So yeah, keep that in mind. Now we're going to train up another army. I'm going to actually train up another minion army. That was pretty fun, to be honest. Okay, so that's it, you guys. I think I'm going to end the video. So, if you did enjoy this video, then please be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Also, let me know down below in the comment section if you are going to use the mass minion attack strategy. Let me know down below in the comment section, please. And if you do use it, let me know down below in the comment section after you've used it if it did work out for you guys and if you are going to continue using it during this event. So, with that being said, if you haven't already but you do enjoy my content, then please be sure to subscribe to my channel for daily videos. And with all that being said, you guys, my name is, of course, Sasha, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.